Hey, what's up guys, Lynn Ray here, and today I want to talk about why I decided to start learning to code. Now, I briefly talked about this in one of my previous videos, but that video was more about the, the genesis of this whole coding thing. But today I want to talk about why I have decided to start learning again 25 years later. Now, the biggest thing for me is is the experience. Um, well, is experience. Let me talk about my, my, my current job first. My current job is a, a really good job. You know, it, it, uh, it's, it pays decent. You know, it pays okay. Um, I help people, it, you know, so it's beneficial to people, you know, if they're willing to receive it, you know, that's another story. Um, it's a good job, you know, it's, uh, it's one of those professions that I believe is, is similar to like being a doctor, right, or being a nurse, right? Those jobs are always needed and they are beneficial, you know, they, and people respect them because of what they do and because you know they provide a, a good service and so I believe my job is along those lines um, now let's go back to the whole experience thing there are many things that I want to experience in my life many things that I want my children to experience and um, in order to experience those things it all comes down to having more pay right or an increase in pay and that's one of my biggest things. Um, and there, I mean, there's also some other things as well. I'll, I'll hit on that in a minute here. But the biggest thing is uh, is the experience, right? And so I want to be able to experience some things with my children. I want my ch children to experience some things, such as traveling out of the country, you know, seeing you know foreign lands and seeing how other people live and, and having those experiences. Um, and I, I want to do the same. Um, my, you know, I want to be able to see my family, you know, my family, they live, you know, almost 2,000 miles away from me, and uh, the only time I really get to see them is due to uh, crisis, you know, which sucks, right? Who wants to only see their family when they're grieving, when there's, when they, you know, in a time of need, you know, so I want to be in a position to where I can, you know, visit my family, <clears throat> You know, and, and enjoy time with them during the good times, not during those, those you know, the, the bad times. So I'm going to have a sip of this coffee here. 7-Eleven, $1.25, or 79 cents, I think it was. And so, and so here's the second reason why I have decided to venture into coding. And it is equally as important as the first reason. And it is health reasons, you know. I work in a job, so I work. I, I do physical therapy, uh, which is again, as I said earlier, yeah, it's it's an amazing job, right? It's a good job, but it's very. Um, I don't know. I don't. I, I want to sound, you know, sound a certain way, but um, but I pick up people quite a bit, which sucks. So picking up people is different than picking up a barbell um, you know back in the days when I used to work out uh, well when I used to work out big you know I could deadlift freaking you know over 300 something pounds um, but picking up a 95 pound person is actually harder than picking up a barbell that weighs 300 and something pounds uh, the barbell doesn't move the barbell is stiff, it stays in its position, whereas a person who is limp, it's very hard to pick these people up, it's very bad on your back, it's very bad um, on just on your joints in general, just lifting people all the time, because, you know, people, you know, the people that I work with do require that, and, uh, and, I, and I don't have a problem with that, but, but for me, I actually have some injuries from the military, and, um, you know, these, uh, this lifting people, day in and day out is very stressing taxing on the back right um, you know working in this field i work with people who have back injuries and 
you know these people are some of these people are in their 40s and 50s and in in horrible condition you know due to the due to the you know the back injuries and I don't want to be in that position I don't want to get into a position where I'm 45 years old and I can't walk you know because I decided to continue lifting patients and lifting people you know for another you know amount of years and so those are the, those are kind of the two biggest reasons I want to experience more in life I want my children to experience more in life I want to be able to provide a different type of life for them um, I want to provide a different life type of life for for me and also my mother and my brother you know I want to be able to spend quality time with with my loved ones you know back in Texas and my loved ones uh, here in Utah and uh, that's kind of that probably is the biggest thing honestly just wanted to experience my loved ones more uh, experience travel with my children and uh, and just you know more for medical reasons just for personal you know safety type of reasons and so that's why I decided to go into coding or start to learn coding again I am only about two and a half weeks I think this is probably my third week uh, into it and it's going well like I'm really enjoying it I, I, I'm getting the the CSS down and the HTML and uh, right now I'm, I'm starting into I'm still doing CSS but about to venture into JavaScript which I believe is most important which I'm finding is more important through more and more research that I've been doing so yeah I'm really enjoying it really uh, you know getting into it and I hopefully will go to one of the coding boot camps in August and uh, you know hopefully that will you know I'll gain the knowledge and experience from that and catapult my career a bit further so anyways guys uh thanks for watching thanks for listening to me uh make sure you like subscribe comment and share and i'll talk to you guys later Peace.